All right, so I'm going to be going over how to use Shortcuts on iOS 15. Now, Shortcuts is an amazing app. It allows you to create different automations on your iPhone as well as you can change app icons and do a lot of other cool things. Now, as I'm going over this, if you guys could smash the like button on this video, I would definitely appreciate it. And if you have any questions specifically about Shortcuts as I'm going over it, feel free to message me below in the comments. Okay, anyways, I'm just going to go over a couple examples here of what you can do. And the first thing I want to do is create an automation. Now, you can do so many different automations on here, but the one I wanna check out first for you guys is gonna be a battery charging automation. And this is just gonna give you an idea of all the cool things you can do with shortcuts, right? Okay, anyways, um, now what I'm gonna do here is choose an action for this automation so it's going to be opening up an app right so i'm searching for that and now i got to select an app which is going to be my uh, charging animation app so we're going to find it okay now i'm going to click done and i'm going to show you what this looks like just this one app giving it this automation but it's really cool so when i plug my iphone in it's gonna pull up this animation that i have set using this third party app so check it out Oh yeah, it's even got some music playing. That's pretty sweet, right? All right, so we got an Apple logo animation and without using shortcuts, none of this would even be possible. So this is just one example of what you can do. And now the next thing I'm gonna do is create an app icon. And this is one of the things a lot of people do on shortcuts, but like I said, you can do other things like these automations and there's a lot of different ones. But uh, we'll do one here for the app store. So let's say you want to create a custom app icon. You can do, do that or just change an app icon. So we're just going to click select here. We're going to name what we're going to do here, which is going to be app store. Now, kind of back to the same thing here. You need to give an action for this, right? So we're going to use the action open app. Okay, and then we're going to choose the app, which is going to be the app store. Okay, and now we got to name it and give it a picture, right? So check this out. All right, click and add to home screen. And we got the purple app store icon looking real slick, right? Okay, now I'm going to click done, and then you can see it'll put it on the home screen. Now, when you click on it, it's going to open it, but it's going to give a little icon at the top that says use the shortcut in order to use that. And uh, this is just another example of what you can do on shortcuts. So, I mean, iOS 15, uh, it is a little bit different on here. I'm not gonna lie from using shortcuts on iOS 14 to 15. There's just a, a couple minor differences in how it looks and how you add things. But for the most part, I definitely recommend everybody use this app. It's free, you can have a lot of fun with it, and you can create automations, app icons, and a bunch of other cool things. Okay, anyways, hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please smash the like button, subscribe to the channel if you haven't. Thanks for watching, and we will see you in the next one.